Well, if I was to think about what I really love about boarding, um, I love dinner time. I love sitting down with students and engaging with them over a meal, finding out how they're going, uh, how their days have been. Usually they don't like them because they've just had a long day of school, but uh, it's just good to to hear where they're at. And I also love I love assisting kids in homework. I love seeing them uh, engaging in what they're doing and trying to actually get them to to uh, to work out things for themselves and and trust in their own ability to learn. Um, and that's really powerful. Uh, yeah, just watching them like getting their study and stuff in order and it's, uh, it is encouraging when kids turn around and they are better students than I was. I love the opportunity and the privilege of watching young people develop and sharing their lives with them as they share theirs with me and my two young children um, in the unique environment that is a boarding house. So something I really like about being a uh, boarding house supervisor is that I get challenged again. So ever since being an adult people just sort of uh, accept your points of views, but I find with the teenagers, if I say it's homework time now, or probably shouldn't wear that out if you're going out, they challenge you and they say why, and they it's, it's nice to be challenged again and have to actually think back through some of the norms that we've just been ingrained with and go back to the roots and pass them on to someone else. Uh, basically what I like about being a um, boarding school supervisor is having, like, being able to expose myself to all sorts of kids, different type of um, teenagers with different personalities and things like that, um, being able to see more, um, basically expose myself to a lot of, I guess, um, experiences where not a lot of people, you know, will be able to have dealing with adults, adult, adult, adult. <laughs> yeah, yeah, <laughs> teenager, um, and. Yeah, you know, the, the problems that they face and things like that. Plus, um, being a, an international student, I guess it's a very good chance for me to, um, to actually have first-hand experience um, seeing what teenagers over here in Australia um, is, are facing compared to what um, you know, teenagers from Malaysia, from where, where I am from, um, are facing. Yeah, so it's, it's really a very good experience. Uh, when people ask me about boarding and ask me what my role is, and I don't like to give them a specific role because if I told them what I actually did, they wouldn't understand with the title of the role. But the easiest way to explain it, it's like being a father of 50 old boys. And I enjoy that component of it. I don't know how to change nappies, I don't know how to bottle feed a child. The one thing I do know how to do is to deal with teenagers and to nurse them through those difficult years from about the ages of 12 through to about 20. And I guess I act as a father figure in the boarding house, providing pastoral care and behaviour management for a lot of boys that need it while they're away from home. And that's a very rewarding experience. It's something I really enjoy. It's something I've enjoyed for a number of years now and it's something I'll enjoy in the future.